What's up my cuties? This is your cute TEs back again with another mukbang. And if you're new to this channel, new to watch me or new to follow me. I recommend it for you. I would love to be part of the QT gang, QT family, whatever you call it, as long as you join. <sighs> we all good, we all Gucci. Alright, so y'all happy Monday. And I'm not eating a really big meal as y'all can see in front of me. We eating something light and something healthy. So I went to my acme and they had these like uh fruit bowls um it was more than just this one but you know i love strawberries kiwi and pineapple so they had this for like four bucks so i got two of them and yeah so that's what we're gonna eat so y'all see i gotta try to get it set up as pretty as possible but y'all know i just <laughs> work with what i got and then i have for my drink i got some um deer park natural spring water has always on that because I can't live without my Deer Park water. And then also, y'all, we got this <laughs> drink. Now, my mom gave me this drink. I'm pretty sure she can hear me. But she gave me this nasty. It's not really nasty. But she gave me this not so great bubbly wine that she got off online. Like I told y'all, she orders her wine and stuff online. It gets delivered to her house. So this wine she got cost five bucks. Now, in the reviews, she it, it was rated five stars. But... And you're supposed to pair it with seafood and then when you taste it now at the beginning it tastes sweet and then it has a better taste so i don't know if i really want to show it to y'all but it's really good with seafood so for all my seafood mukbangers that love to eat seafood this is called moscato vino and this is an italian wine this is good for seafood it's great with seafood but of course you know me i still wanted to try some and I tasted it. It has a nasty aftertaste. I'm not even going to lie. So I put a little strawberry in here. I don't know if you guys can see it. I'm being a little bougie today. It's Monday for y'all. But it's not Monday for me. So I can, I'm allowed to have a little drinky drink. <laughs> okay. Alright. So let's get into this fruit. Because I'm ready to eat it. Oh my god. I love fruit. So should we go into the kiwi first? Duh. I don't know why they don't give you a lot. Y'all see how the, what I have in front of me is all the kiwi that they gave me. They gave me a bunch of strawberries and pineapple and not enough kiwi. But it's okay. So that is the kiwi. Kiwi, kiwi. Ooh, that focused perfectly. Mmm. Mmm. There's nothing like a sweet kiwi. Mmm. Mmm. So freaking good. Now we're going to eat a strawberry. You know, it comes in a package, so it's pre sliced. Mm hmm. Strawberries are really only the best when it's strawberry season. I think that's like May or something like that. Mm. Let's eat a piece of pineapple. Pineapple. Who does a pineapple under the sea? SpongeBob SquarePants. Doom, doom, doom. <laughs> All right. Mmm. This pineapple is sweet. Mmm. And juicy. Mm. All right, y'all. So. Like I've been telling y'all about this root canal appointment. I know you guys are probably wondering. So how did your root canal appointment go? We're going to get into that. So y'all. Here's the tea. Sips tea. So I did not get my root canal done on Thursday. Um, turns out that they were running behind, running late. So they rescheduled it. And now I go back February 5th on a Tuesday at 7.55 in the morning. So he pretty much wanted, then he pretty much my, uh, the, uh, orthodontist pretty much put me on a more, another antibiotic. This time it's a 300 milligrams and y'all, the pigs are huge. They're horse pills and I still have to take them every six hours. So yeah, cause he said it's still a little bit of swelling in my mouth, but he said that I should be fine. And he said, once I leave, you know, the, or once I get the root canal done, Go back to my dentist. He'll see what's going on after. And then therefore, therefore. But yeah, so. But that was pretty much it, you guys. No, I didn't get my root canal. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. But I guess everything happens for a reason. So, you know, I didn't get it. That kiwi. 
it's good i'm sorry it's really good i wish they would have gave me more kiwi i love I mean, i love pineapple and strawberry too but y'all could have given me more kiwi like y'all's being real stingy with that <laughs> and i was gonna add some chocolate but i didn't want to be fat i was trying to be healthy you know the only thing really fattening is this little bit of wine and i put a strawberry in there i cannot wait to eat the strawberry and see what it tastes like I mean, that's pretty much it and then my big boss the big boss the boss of my gm the one that works at red lobster he came down today and uh i just hate how <laughs> the managers act when he comes because they try to put like things that they're supposed to do they don't never do it until he comes like they're putting times on everything acting like they cared about how the line was asking if i wanted something to drink all this kind of stuff when is it any other time do you ask me if i'm thirsty or do i need anything you literally watch me suffer or fend for myself so don't try to act fake i'm just looking at them like i just laugh i couldn't stop laughing because it's just like y'all know y'all like soon as he leaves y'all can go right back into the same bull crap same thing when the health inspector comes they always try to clean up and straighten up but any other time they don't clean it's a mess in there i'm just be like y'all just be faking <laughs> fake them don't be fake <laughs> don't be fake <laughs> I don't know what he's doing over here, y'all. This is really good. I'm so happy that I did this. I love fruit. Let me know down in the comments. What's your favorite fruit? I knew there was a challenge. Each one reach one fruit challenge. I mean, I wasn't tagged in that. But I like fruit. So I figured why not do a fruit muck bang. You know, be a little healthy. Because I do. I had been eating a little heavy. Well, not too heavy. The um, only thing I had this week really was heavy was the seafood. But all that butter and garlic and all that <laughs> shrimp and crab legs, those were bomb though. And then what else? I mean, I mean, I haven't been eating too bad. I drink plenty of water. I try to like drink at least eight glasses or more a day or bottles because I go through water like a, I go through water like a fish. Like I literally, oh yeah, y'all. So I, when I went to Acme and got these uh, these fruit, these fruit bowls or whatever. They also had three for ten Deer Park water, so you get three cases for ten dollars. Who ain't jump on that, honey? I sure did. Got all three, and it was twenty four pack. Now, if it would have been thirty two packs, three of them, ninety six bottles of water. Oh my god! But I can't. I mean, you know, I can deal with seventy. What seventy two? That's fine. You know, we can make it work. But yeah, so I got that, and literally, like, I literally when I left the um or orthodontist appointment. I was kind of happy because I went to Walgreens, got my prescription. Then I went to, you know, right, you know, the Acme was right across from the street from Walgreens. So I went over there, got a little few things, got some fruit, got my water, got some other stuff. But yes, I'm happy. <laughs> I was running solo on water. I had literally like one bottle. This was the only thing I had left. This was the last one of the other case, but I've already broken into like one already. And I was craving some tacos, so my chicken tacos, so I'll be having them again on my channel. So <laughs> I'm just giving y'all a little heads up that I love tacos, so they will be on my channel a lot. I love pasta, that'll be on my channel a lot. And I love shrimp, that'll be on my channel a lot. And I love chicken. And I really want some more Chinese fried chicken because that was bomb. Red, sweet, and sour sauce. But I ain't gonna do it. It is good though. I'm so happy that <laughs> Be Love and Eat Q both did it because if y'all didn't do it, I'll be lost in the saw. This pineapple is so sweet. Every piece is sweet. And every piece is soft. You know how some pieces would be hard. This is really good. 
Oh, I felt too soon. I know I didn't. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Cheers. <laughs> Cheers to a great, productive, and prosperous week, y'all. Don't get a case of the Mondays. Don't. I know I'm probably going through it right now because, you know, right now I'm not at work. I'm chilling at home, relaxing, but I know I'm probably hoping for the best. Oh, yeah, so this week, Lobster Fest starts. I don't know if any of you guys go eat yeah, red lobster or light red lobster. I know Isis loves red lobster, the, the biscuits and the scampi and the shrimp. She loves, ooh, <laughs> I'm feeling fine up with y'all. I'm sorry, guys. <laughs> mm. The thought of red lobster makes me angry. I'm throwing stuff. Anyway, <laughs> but um, yeah, uh, lobster fest starts. That's more expensive than endless shrimp. Endless shrimp is more of a okay. We make we make the lobster fest. Lobster fest is more people that want to spend money. Lobster fest is the highest promo. Like that's the one that costs that bread, that <laughs> that money. That's when they want the people with the money to come out, and they always make sure that they always do and lobster fest during tax time because they know once people get their money they gonna want to go out to eat they gonna order steaks and lobsters and shrimps and all that because they got tax money but y'all know as soon as uh what march 1st come ain't gonna be no more money they gonna spend all of it and the way it's looking right now with this government shutdown honey um ain't nobody going out to eat i noticed that red lobster has not been busy as usually is because of this government shutdown because a lot of people don't have you know, got money to be, you know, spending. I know a lot of people are selling their food stamps. I know one of my coworkers, she bought at least $100 worth of food stamps from someone, one lady because she don't have no money. <laughs> it's crazy. I ain't gonna get in all that, though. <laughs> Let him worry about that. Because it's making a girl marry great again, you guys. Ain't that what he said? We saying what you doing? Anyway, I don't what I want to talk about. Like I said, digging my root canal. Got plenty of waters. I want tacos. Oh yeah, taco a taco mukbang will be coming, and another nacho. Oh my god, y'all. Them Snoopy eat nachos. I always think about them all the time. Them chicken nachos, y'all. When I say I marinated that chicken to perfection. It was seasoned, the lettuce was fresh, the chips, the cheese, the salsa. Oh my god, everything was so good. The sour cream. Oh my god. All I would need it was a little bit of pico. Oh my god, y'all. I'm thinking about that right now while I'm eating fruit. That's bad. I'm eating fruit thinking about fattening food. This is why I need to eat this because I eat too much. <laughs> mm -hmm. But don't get me wrong, I like both. I like fattening and I like healthy. That's why I always try to drink water with everything. So at least can, I can at least do that, you know. <laughs> at least do that. <laughs> I don't want to drink bad food and drink a soda. Mm -mm. But I know one thing for sure. After this, I'm going to need something to eat. Because, you know, fruit don't really fill you up. People say, oh, fruit is so filling. No, it ain't to me. Just like if I go to um, Walmart and I'll buy grapes or something. And... I bought like a pound and a half. I try to get the biggest bag. The hardest one too is I like I like hard grapes. Sometimes I like to put them in the freezer to make them hard, so they be nice and crisp. I don't like soft grapes, but yeah, I can just eat fruit all day and not get full. But I really, really this reminds me of why I really want a fruit salad with like some strawberries. Pineapples, kiwi, blackberries, raspberries, mandarines, and like all together in some apple juice. My mom made this one time, y'all. Oh my god, it was so good. So good and so healthy. Mm. We had just came back from the gym. And we used to go to the gym together. And she made it, y'all. It was so good. <laughs> I realized one of my favorite fruits was in there. Plus apple juice. Really bad. I don't know what Bear's doing, but I don't like it. <laughs> I'm sorry, y'all. It's like I talk and I don't. I'm trying to save this kiwi. I don't know if y'all noticed. I'm trying to save it because there ain't that much left. It's so sweet. <laughs> Jesus. One love diva. Jesus. Jesus is in this, this fruit. 
He might not be in this drink. The strawberry gonna make it. You know, the, the strawberry is starting to the top now, y'all. That strawberry did something there. A little, little something, something. A little something, something. <laughs> <laughs> Let me stop. Mm. God, that kiwi. That kiwi. Y'all see, I'm trying to eat, I'm trying to eat the stuff in the back for y'all so the setup will still be cute because the back is literally empty. There's nothing the back here. I'm ready to go to the front. Eat these strawberries. It was for decoration. Now it's over. I'm hungry. Just kidding. Yo, B. Oh my god, I love the B. Simone tone. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I love it. But I do it all the time. She's funny. <laughs> I love her. I love when she says, "Baby boy, <laughs> baby girl." I listen. You're my boyfriend. Oh my god, I love when she says that. She's so funny and she's so cute. And then, um, yes, I'm pretty V, y'all. If y'all don't know who they are on Instagram, please go watch them because they're so funny. Funny because she be like, Peanut, call your damn daddy now. <laughs> she funny, yo. Yes, I'm pretty V. Like she's funny. I'm sorry. Her be someone. It's so many funny people. J that girl, J Cole, the one that be uh. In a Chilean outfit. Oh. Ooh, excuse me, Jalil. That was for you. Was that that was a manly one? Cause I ain't, I don't even got no ginger ale. Maybe it's just one. I may have to drink this with some seafood. No, I no, I'm not. I ain't even gonna lie. <laughs> mm -mm. Nope. That wasn't a good strawberry. I miss strawberry season. I cannot wait for corn season, y'all. I'm excited. I already took a thumbnail. Duh. Psh, I'm losing my mind. Oh my god, y'all. Look at this big piece of pineapple in the back. Whoa. You know what this looks like? I hope I know my shapes. This looks like a rhombus. Or am I tripping, you guys, from school? See. Our shapes. This looks like a rhombus. Isn't a rhombus have five sides? One, two. No. Sorry, y'all. See? That's a trapezoid. Wait. Y'all, am I tripping? Doesn't a rhombus have... Is it rhombus? Rhombus have four sides or is it five? It kind of looks like a rhombus or is it a trapezoid that I think... I think it's a trapezoid. They have four sides. Let me know if I'm wrong. I think I am. I don't know. <laughs> One, it looks like either a trapezoid or a rhombus. One of them. <laughs> it's sweet. I'm not trying to use my bottom teeth like that. <laughs> yes, I mean, I do have pretty teeth at the top, at least. Oh, my God, y'all. When I was in the dentist, he kept banging on them and, like, tapping on them. Like, just looking like, um, is this a test? And he did, like, a hot test, a field test. Like, can you feel this? Can you feel that? I felt everything. He was like, oh, interesting. I'm just ready to get this done. That's it, and that's all. I got more things I gotta get done. Or I wanna get them all done before the summer so that when the summer comes, I ain't gotta worry about nothing. I can just have fun. Work, of course, but still have fun. Last time I didn't do nothing but sleep all day after I got off. I gotta get out of there because I need to do stuff and meet people and go places. This is a big piece. We don't wanna put this whole piece in my mouth. Let me see you bounce with them left and do the shoulder, shoulder. Mm -hmm. Get it right, two step and your shoulder. Hey, 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 bow. <laughs> Let me get off this camera because I ain't got nothing to talk about. I ain't talking about nothing, nothing at all. This fruit is bomb though. I ain't gonna cat. Let's taste this strawberry though before we get off. No, let's see if it tastes good. <laughs> I'm excited. Yeah, oh, I'm trying to stab my fork in it. Stab that strawberry. All right, you guys. Let's see if it tastes good or not. Oh. 
All right, this is the test. Nah, that ain't it. <laughs> it just made it taste like the, the wine. There's no. <laughs> nope, next. <laughs> next. Not feeling that. Anyway, y'all. Thank you guys so much for watching. And if you're not already subscribed to my channel, QT Eats, I would love you part of the QT gang, QT family. Y'all join the gang. We litty, okay? You know you want to join. And if you made it this far, that means you love me, period. Period. So go ahead and subscribe. Make sure the notifications are always on so you never miss another video from your words truly. And please like, comment, share. And yeah. Share this video so everybody knows they know who this cute face is so they can subscribe to my channel. And leave a comment down below because I do always read and reply. Might not be right away, but I always get to my comments. I don't want y'all to feel like that. every time I reply to her, every time I write her a comment, she don't wait, she don't ever reply. Y'all, I'm not good with commenting. I'm not good with texting. I'm not I'm not that kind of person, but I get to it eventually. It just takes me time. I'm just not fast with it. I'm getting there. It's a process. <laughs> but I love y'all. I, I always heart like, like, even y'all, like, Aunt Dar knows. Because she'll leave me comments and I'll see it and I'll write something in my head. But I don't physically do it. But I always remember what she writes. I always write it back. Like, everybody. Like, everybody knows that about me. <clears throat> Excuse me. But yes, all my social media links will be down in the description box below. Thank you guys so much for following me. And I always wait till last minute to say this. I'm going to make sure I start saying this in the beginning. But shout out to all my old QTs. Shout out to all my new QTs in the building. Shout out to all the ones to come. And yep, let's keep going up, up, up. We almost to 300 subs, y'all. I cannot believe it. I would love to hit 300 subs before the end of January. But, you know... It's all trusting the process. Like my girl J. Let's Eat says, I'm trusting this process. So I will see you guys on Tuesday. I hope you guys are having a great Monday. And don't let anybody ill bear this farted. <laughs> okay, bye y'all.